have 15 minutes a day to be successful online, what do you do? What do you do if you only really only have 15 minutes a day? What I always tell people is there are three things you need to do because you need three results. What are the three result, results you want? Number one is you want exposure. How do you get exposure on LinkedIn? How do you get tens of thousands of people to notice that you exist? Number two, you want credibility. You want people to trust you. People do business with other people that they know, like, and trust. So you need to learn how to build that credibility. For example, you want to get a top voice badge on LinkedIn. You want to get recommendations on LinkedIn. Number three is you want to book meetings. What's the process of booking meetings on LinkedIn? How do you make sure that you get those meetings? If you want to be more successful, you know you need to have those meetings. So how do you get it? Hit the like button hit the repost button and leave a comment letting me know what you do for a living so that I can see what you're up to here on LinkedIn. And I'm going to share my screen in just a moment, but I want to encourage you and make you realize that success on LinkedIn and any other marketing platform is not about getting lucky, but about having the right strategy. I believe that the right strategy will save you a decade. Most people are spraying and praying. That means that they're throwing things at the wall, hoping that something should stick. Hope is a great thing. Hope is not a strategy. What you need is you need a plan. You need to know who the people are that you want to target. And then you need to make sure that you have the right promise, the right messaging for those people. Then you need to tell them stories. Once you have tons of stories that you can tell them, whether it's on LinkedIn Live like this, or whether it's through videos, clips, images, text. There's many different ways that you can tell stories. You need to have the right presence. Is your profile optimized? Do you have the right headline? Do you have the right about section? Do you have the right elements on your profile set up correctly? Then you need to make sure you're using the right tools. The tool that I'm going to be showing you today is called EVYAI, E-V-Y-A-I. It'll help you get exposure, get credibility, and book more meetings with LinkedIn. So if you want to be successful, tune into this presentation, give it a like, let me know that you're here, let me know what you do for a living and let's dig right in. So this is what my LinkedIn currently looks like. I'm going to click on the LinkedIn homepage. Somebody recently asked me, he said, Joe, how do I find people in a particular industry on LinkedIn? For example, HR managers, you go to the search box on top, you type in HR manager. Okay. So if I want an HR manager, I got to can make sure that I'm connecting with those HR managers. Most people do not have enough connections. How many connections do you have on LinkedIn? Now, how many HR managers are there on LinkedIn? Just click people on the top left and check to see how many HR managers even exist on LinkedIn. I don't know. Check. What does it say here? 3.7 million results. That's a ton of people. That's a ton of people. Do you want to be able to connect with these people? really really key to connect with the right people online if you're not connected to the right people how are they supposed to follow you how are you supposed to be successful if you're not connected with the right people somebody said joe can you send me your linkedin url i'm going to say live now live now on my profile okay so i just sent them the link to my linkedin url and i am live now on my profile okay so now Let's talk about posting, engaging, and messaging. Let's take a look at some of the posts that I've recently posted. So this is a repost over here. It says repost on my profile over here. It says repost. I reposted this. This was a post by Darren Mass. He said the two booming industries that our business owners should be aware of is AI and LinkedIn. Joe happens to be in the intersection of both. He has a booming AI startup, 46,000 followers on LinkedIn, and an impressive marketing background. So we went on a hike together. And if you want to listen to this hike, you can listen to it right over here. It says listen here. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave a comment with the details of that inside this post so you guys can grab it right over here. You see, I'm just going to go here, listen here. And now I just put the listen here link. I just copied it from here to here. Now I'm going to tag Darren, Darren Mass. Thanks for having me on the podcast. Thanks for having me on the podcast. Okay, so he had me, we went on a hike together. We had an amazing conversation. He had me on the podcast. I just tagged him. Now, Mac wants to know where I am. So I'm going to click Mac. 
I am live now. Okay, so I'm just going to tag in so he gets a notification that I am live right now. So if you want people to know that you exist, you got to post. So you see, I posted this here. I said, he said he's not good at social media. I said, how many posts did you write? How many comments did you create? How many messages did you send? He replied, very few. I wonder why you're not getting results from your LinkedIn activity. You didn't put in the time or hire someone to do it for you. How much time should someone spend on LinkedIn? Well, at least 15 minutes a day. So I recommend 15 minutes a day. Write a post just like this one. Or you can have AI write the post for you. You see this post right over here? This post was entirely written by AI. This image over here was a clip that came from artificial intelligence. Now, I posted this 275 impressions, 1,000, 1,100 impressions on this one. This one had 358 impressions. It's almost 3,000 impressions on this one. You see, my average post gets about 1,000 impressions. I'm always posting online. I'm constantly posting. Why am I posting? Because posting gets me exposure. If you want more exposure, you need to post. But where do you go? Where do you go to post? So if you go to my profile, under my name, your season is Try Chat GPT for LinkedIn. When you click on that, it's going to take you straight to my website, eviai.com. If you click on login, if you have an account with eviai, you'll be able to simply see all the different activities that I have here, but you'll be able to click on the post writer and you'll be able to simply write a post. So I can literally write a post about anything. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to go, go back here and take a post that I've already written, like this one here. I already wrote this post. I'm going to take this post, copy it, and I'm going to paste it in here just like this. I'm going to change the tone to make it friendly. I'm going to make the goal more inspirational. I'm going to go for inspiration. Uh, the goal for encourage engagement. Okay, I'm going to do that. And now I am going to just include hashtag success and hashtag speaker. Okay, so I'm going to delete the hashtag success, hashtag speaker, and I'm going to choose GPT uh, 4.0, and I'm going to hit generate. It's going to use my persona, and it's going to rewrite this post for me. So I love rewriting posts that I've all written, already written in the past, and then scheduling them for later. So if you're not doing that, if you're not taking your posts and rewriting them with a post writer, I highly recommend doing that, especially if you wrote the post yourself and you want a more AI written post um, that mimics the way that you do it. Networking is not a magic trick. It's a commitment. I recently had a conversation with a friend who was frustrated with his lack of results on LinkedIn. And you could also turn this into a video. Watch this. I'm going to stop sharing my screen and I'm going to I'm going to tell you a story. I recently had a conversation with a friend who was frustrated by his lack of results on LinkedIn. He admitted that he had written a few posts, barely commented, and he almost never sent messages. No wonder he wasn't getting results. Whether you're a seasoned professional or a newbie, LinkedIn is a platform where you need to put in the time or hire someone to do it for you. It's not about spending your entire day on it, but strategically spending 15 minutes a day that can make a significant difference in your success. Remember, the word network, N-E-T-W-O-R-K, has the word work in it for a reason. It takes effort to build relationships and connect with people. That's why there's so much value in it, because very few people are doing it. I recently booked a speaking gig from a call I had with a LinkedIn connection. Speaking gigs are very valuable to me because they help me gain more exposure and attract clients. And by the way, I'm going to be speaking at WeWork on February 22nd in Brooklyn. If you're interested in learning more about leveraging LinkedIn, maybe you should come to the event on February 22nd at 4 p.m. Do you want to come? Say, Joe, I'm in. I'd love to join your event. Can you see the way I just turned that post into a video? It gave me content based on content that I already wrote in the past. Now, I have over 5,000 posts that I can just rewrite in a whim change the goal, change the tone, change the persona, change the call to action, mess around, put a video, put an image, put a poll, put a document. There's so many different things I can turn it into. Once you create content, once you start creating content, you can spin that content and turn it into a massive library of content that and then that doesn't take you more than just a minute, two minutes, five minutes to post, even with selecting a nice image. So I would highly, highly encourage you to start posting to get exposure. The second thing you want to be doing, and let me share my screen to show you the second thing. I'm going to share my window. I'm going to share this window over here. 
So the second thing I want you to be doing is I want you to strategically comment on people's posts. So Mark Borelli, he's a client of mine. I want to leave a comment on his post right now. I'm going to select uh, Evy AI as the persona. He said, ever been to a conference with those aha moments? I'm going to say, Mark Borelli, your emphasis on the trifecta, detailed process, consistency, and perseverance is spot on. Okay, so I'm going to go like that. I'm going to tag him just like that. And boom, I just tagged Mark Borelli just like that. Perfect timing. That is le literally lever leveraging this to leave comments on people's posts. How long did it take me to leave a comment? If you're not commenting consistently on people's posts, you're seriously missing out on the exposure. I recommend leaving 10 to 20 comments a day. And with Evy AI, you can literally leave comments like this in seconds. You can use our extension to leave comments. By the way, if you love leaving comments, leave a comment on this post right now. I'd love to see you inside this post. Let me know what you think about this particular post, this particular live right now. I'd love to hear from you. Let me see the comments that people have been leaving here. Okay, it looks like Brian says, looking to network. Anyone who's interested, Brian. Boom. Definitely give him a call. He's a good dude. I just had a conversation with him the other day. So what do you want to do? How are you going to become more successful? For me, it's also about sending people direct messages. Let's say, for example, somebody goes to my profile. I click on profile views. I see the people that are looking at my profile. I see George looked at my profile. He's a CEO of Brave Solutions. Excellent. I'm going to go to his profile. I see he's based in Colombia. If I want to build a relationship with him, I can send him a connection request. In this case, his profile looks a little generic to me, so I'm not really going to connect with him. But he did check out my profile. I'm going to check out Daniel Raffaelli, head of management. So cool. I see I'm already connected to him. I'm going to click message. I sent him a happy birthday message. Look at this. I've been sending him messages a lot. I'm going to say... Thanks for checking my profile. Do you ever respond to messages? OK, now I can have AI help me write up a nice little document. I'm going to write curious, just like that. OK, I said, do you ever reply to messages? Curious, because I've been sending him happy birthday messages. I've been sending him different things, and he's never, ever responded to me. So what I'm going to do is I see that this guy is not really, he may not be serious about being a relationship with me so i can just hit the more button and i can hit remove connection and be done with him so if he doesn't respond to this i'll probably disconnect from him because i see he's not really serious about being my connection and i need to make room i don't have a lot of room left look how much room i have left i have 29,451 connections so i just have about 500 more connections i want to make room for amazing people like Kristen or hannah or jennifer or ashok or shira or or all these people who have been messaging me and building relationships. Really, really powerful. That would be great. Best uh, cell number for you. Okay, I'm gonna say best cell number for you. Now, I can click on this little tool over here. I can ask her this with the AI, and let's see what the AI will write for me. I wanna build a relationship. I wanna use an authoritative tone, and I wanna use this particular persona right over here. You see that? I say best cell phone number for you, and then it'll just write up the persona. Hey, Stacy, delighted to hear you're interested in talking more about AI. It's a game changer. Let's grab a virtual coffee. Could you please share your best cell phone number? Boom. So you see the AI wrote that entire thing for me. All right. Let's stop sharing my screen and wrap up over here. Just a quick video. Hit the repost button if you got value from this. Leave a comment. Let me know what you do for a living. Let me know where you're based. Let me know how I can add value to your life. Let me know if there's a recent book that you've read that you absolutely loved. I'd love to hear from you in the comments. Let's have a real conversation. This was episode number 33 of 244. I hope you got value from it. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed it. I really enjoy sharing my life with you. I really enjoy sharing inspiration. I really appreciate connecting with you and getting to know you. I do have tens of thousands of people that follow me on LinkedIn, but not everybody reaches out. Not everybody connects. Not everybody wants to go deep. Also, I'm launching a community of engaged LinkedIn users who are thought leaders and also love to network. If you're a thought leader, if you're an engaged LinkedIn user and you love to network and you want to be included in this community, just write community in the comments and I'll send you a form that you could fill out where you can be invited to our next conversation about being one of the founding members of launching this community. Thank you very much for joining me here today. I really appreciate you being here. I want to bless you to have an amazing, prosperous day full of abundance. And go watch this video again if you want to learn how to use AI. And make sure to download evyai.com. Sign up for a free account. And if you like it, go to evyai.com upgrade.